Hello. Hello Hi. out there. How's it going? Sorry for the brief delay. Um, tech companies experience technical difficulties too. And the Facebook app yeah. was crashing. Yeah. But what do you say? That's a great example. What are you supposed like, to do about that? It, it crashes. <laughs> what are you going to do? So, it happens, but thank you for hanging with us there and being patient. Um, today we have some awesome stuff to talk about. So mm -hmm. it's Christmas season. Christmas season. I am not the Grinch. Mm -hmm. I just am waiting to receive my next um, ugly sweater. So, so for Christmas, Mikey G really wants an ugly sweater. Um, and we'd love to hear what you guys want for Christmas. So what's one of the top things on your list? Go ahead and let us know. Um, Top yeah. thing. Top so, things you want for Christmas and or top things you enjoy giving for Christmas and yeah. who, who you might enjoy giving them to. Today is all about giving mm -hmm. and this season is all about giving. So um, anybody yeah. out there, uh, just so we can like let you know, you can, or just so you, we know everybody can hear us, uh, what's one thing you like to give or get for Christmas? And actually, we'll start. While we're waiting for somebody mm -hmm. else to comment in... Um, We'll start. So, like I said, uh, ugly sweaters ugly top sweater. of my list. Though, if I receive an ugly sweater on Christmas, that kind of you just put it over. Okay, so You're I can still use it. Yeah. Yeah. But so I, yeah, and I'll, next sweater. year it'll still be around next next year. Right. That's yeah. the thing with ugly sweaters is they yeah. never go out of style. They, they never. <laughs> yeah. So all you need is one. Yeah. The then, benefit of ugly sweaters. Yeah. It keeps and giving. You're good to go. What do you What do you want for Christmas? Gosh, this year? I really want an Alexa or. Oh yeah. You yeah. Have a, Smart. Yeah. yeah. Those are cool. Yeah. What would you use it for? A timer. Timer. Yeah, I think I would mostly be like. You, yeah. Set the timer for you could like order food on those things. Yeah, I'd probably do that too. That's pretty cool. They're a great yeah. idea. Very popular this year. All uh, right. Anybody and out there, we're going to hang out. We're going to be awkward and patient this time and wait for y'all to comment in. So anybody out there, what's your favorite thing to give or get for Christmas? Or maybe a tradition. What's your favorite tradition, holiday tradition? Yeah, it looks like we have two people. Two, one, one went down oh. to one. Anybody, anybody, okay. anybody. Any cool, what's, any cool holiday traditions that you do, Kimmy? Um, we all go to Mass. Um, Christmas Mass. Christmas yeah. Mass, in church, so that's yeah. a big deal. And um, we get to open one gift on that's, Christmas yep. Eve. So that sounds one pretty, gift. yep, that sounds just yeah. like what we did when yeah. we grew up. Um, all right, we're still going to wait. Anybody out there? Anybody out there? Favorite thing to give or get? Can you hear us? Can you hear Maybe us? they can't hear us. Hopefully. I hope yeah. they can. Hmm. Well, we'll wait 20 more seconds. 20 more seconds. What's one other thing? Let's do what, one thing we love to give for Christmas. Well, you know what I think we should bring up is um, all of our clients receive the book, The Go-Giver. Yep. Um, and one. basically that... If you haven't read it, um, you need to get a copy. And it just talks about how everything's full circle. Absolutely. And everything comes around. So it's important. That's what our topic is today. Yeah. Kind of. So um, we'll elaborate yeah, more on that. You know what, that. too? Um, we like to keep these Facebook conversations really pointed to tips that you can do you know, on your website or maybe mm -hmm. web design. But um, yeah, sometimes we like to get a little bit of philosophy. Yeah. philosophical in there too because that's one thing and you experience this all the time right I mean I if there's I have never maybe met anyone more than Kimmy that is so willing to give before she gets and it's amazing to see her out in the community oh, I mean just this morning we had a meeting this morning yeah she's like how can I help you how can I help you how can I help you and everybody I mean sometimes it's like I swear you catch people off guard they're like yeah why are you being so nice to me you know you never know where <laughs> A connection right. or who you're linking right. with can link, link you to someone yeah. else. So um, it's always good just to yeah. be a go-giver yep. and everything is full circle. Yeah, and I didn't mean to get off topic there. No. I put you on the spot. But it's okay. It's all it's about, okay. yeah. And so just to run through that real quick, like mm -hmm. what is what does that mean to you? You know, the giving full circle and oh. the go-giver. What is, what is like the 10-second way of describing that? Maybe more than 10 seconds. Um, I just... I just want to help others and help others grow That's and it. grow That's their business and yeah. you know. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, and the fundamental idea behind it is giving 
before you, so that you've often heard people say, they're a go-getter, they're a go-getter. Mm -hmm. Well, um, in the video we try and be go-givers, so that um, basic philosophy is, we try and give, 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 and you know, I mean, a lot of things come back full circle, but if, if everyone in the world was always focused on giving, uh, I don't know, that looks like a pretty good yeah. scenario, right? Mm -hmm. Get all fuzzy. This is, see, tis the season, yeah. you know, get all warm and fuzzy. And so that's what we're gonna talk about today. We have um, three, Three tips, Three tips for yep. everyone. Um, really how you can give back to your clients and your yep. networking referrals. Through your website, through social media. These are all great outlets to give on. You know, yeah. you might think about a present, but there are digital presents too, right? right. So what's Absolutely. our first what's our first point here, Kimmy? So Facebook, LinkedIn, yep. um, all your social media that you do. Be on the lookout, you know. Yeah. Um, your networking partners are also posting stuff, um, specials going on, maybe a promotion that they have. Yeah. You want to make sure, like it, share it, read over it. Not only does that help them, but you mm -hmm. also learn what their promotion is yeah. or what they're looking to gain from, yeah. from what they're showing. So it's, you know, it just basically. Highlights. If you ever look at this, so I'll just be very brief here, mm -hmm. but the amount of eyeballs that you can reach on social media is incredible. I mean, if you if you have tens of thousands of people liking you, and that business has tens of thousands of people liking them, and you share something, I mean, that can get out so quick and yeah. impact so many people, and mm -hmm. it's amazing. We love to see that through our clients. Um, so make sure you're just reposting, yeah. liking, sharing. Being active. Yeah. yeah, being active with all your social media and giving back to your clients and your networking partners yeah. and your referral yep. sources. Yep. Um, so then we have number two. Number two. I'll, so inviting clients to be maybe on a promotional blog. So if yeah. you have a blog on your website, um, this is a great way to reach out and mm -hmm. feature. We like to, uh, and so often in web design we say the word hero. Um, so that often describes like the top of the website there, the first mm -hmm. thing people see. But we also like to give kind of like hero sections. Right. Because our clients are our heroes. Mm -hmm. So not to be, con not to be con uh, what do you call it, um, confused. Right. But yeah, we like to think of our clients are our heroes. And we write blogs about our clients quite often. Isn't All it? the time. Yeah, Wonderful. it's really important. Um, if you're not blogging, number one, you really need to be. Mm -hmm. um, but number two, yes, that's a great way to share yeah. and link up. Yeah. Um, have them write something, you know. It's a you know topic of interest that yeah. might be a source to your other clients that Absolutely. they need. Yep. So make Absolutely. sure that you know, you're blogging for yourself, but also get the input from some, some other right. people or have them do a blog post for yeah. you. Yeah, and, and if you do it, that might cause other people to be mm -hmm. um, influenced to do that as well. And that leads us to our third point, Kimmy, which is... Um, linking to your website. Yes. Right? And this... Making sure your website links yep. to who you partner with. So right. if you're in a business where you do partner with other companies, make sure that you showcase that on their website, yeah. on you your website. Blog, you, yeah. yeah. So, so basically, you know, you have their logo on there, so you know you're supporting them, and make sure that logo maybe links right to yeah. that company website. And some text. Um, you know, we hear all the time. There's so many great benefits on SEO to linking to other places, mm -hmm. right? And then having other sites link to you um, just in create, creates an incredible amount of. Google cred, if you want to yeah. call it that, street cred on Google. So uh, Google favors that, they love it. Which and is kind of what we live by. And it's, right. it's all, <laughs> the, these three tips here, they all are so directly related to just giving to others and then having, you can see the immediate or almost immediate benefits from that. It's Absolutely, right? Absolutely. So yeah. those are our three tips. Yeah, let's go over them again. Yep. Number so one. number one is make sure that you're reposting on social media. Um, all the things that your clients or your networking mm -hmm. partners are posting. Yep. And Number two is blogging. So create a personal blog, feature clients, feature others. Number and three. Number three is to make sure who you refer if you have referral partners, showcase them on your website link. and link them. And link them. You know? Yep. And another great thing you could showcase is pictures if that's Yeah, absolutely. Too. I so. mean pictures are with a thousand words. Yep. Right. Cool. Well this guys, is have uh, a Merry Christmas. Mikey G. Yeah. This is Kimmy. Kimmy. Have a great Christmas, like she said. Enjoy everyone. Yeah. Eat tons of food. Get tons of presents.
Signing off. See you later.